Hey, it's Gothy, and I'm doing my little um, World of Warcraft video. Um, this, I've been meaning to do this for a long time, so please do bear with me. Um, so hopefully my microphone doesn't pick up too much interference, like I've got my fan on in the background, so um, just because it's hot and I can't actually move my microphone around too much. It's a static microphone, so yes. Um, so this is still Miss of Pandaria and um, I'm picking up my Warlords of Draenor in about two hours time so even though it doesn't go live till tomorrow I thought I would just show off my characters and where they are at the moment in Warlords uh, in Miss of Pandaria. Alright so to start with um, this is just one of my little baby alts. This is the character that's going to get my level 90 boost that I get with Warlords of Draenor. Um, so this is a warrior and a blood elf so yeah not very exciting and we start with my 90s um, so this is my one alliance character um, not geared at all pretty much um, so this is a rogue and it's a worgen then I have my um, level 90 paladin and I really need to take that tabard off because it just ruins the uh, half ass transmog that I have so Yep, that's my paladin. Uh, this is my death knight, my venomous. Um, yeah, level ninety as well. Very not geared. Like the only the only character I have that are geared are uh, pretty much my hunter and my warlock. Everything else is just kind of alts. Um, this is my shaman. This is Alkanash. Alkanash. <coughs> I quite like the goblin models. Um, this is my monk. Again, not gear, and she doesn't have any transmog gear yet either. Um, this is my shadow priest, who's not looking very shadow there, but she's a DPS. I don't actually have any healers or tanks at this point in time. Um, then we have my druid. Um, she's currently balanced, but I'm thinking I might learn feral and go kitty for warlords. I'm not sure yet. She's an alt though, so she has plenty. I have plenty of time to decide. Uh, this is my mage. This is Thalidomide. He's a little bit transmogged. Um, most of my characters don't have much in the way of transmog gear, except for my warlock, because my warlock is my main. Um, and this is my hunter, and I do love that bow. And again, not very much transmog gear. So, and then this is my warlock. And she is my main, so she has all of the achievements and the mounts and the pets and the transmog gear. So, yes. So let's have a look. So I'm pretty much just going to be showing off some of the stuff that I've got from Mists of Pandaria and stuff. So, yeah. And I'm in the auction house. Alright, so let's just find somewhere sort of out of the way. Let's just go sit up here. Okay. So you can see I'm sort of working on some achievements there. <coughs> Alright. So this is my warlock and she's my main character. So she's currently Gothrilla the Crazy Cat Lady. Um, Destro Warlock. She's actually 570. Why is that only 530? What have I got? Oh. I've got to put my cloak back on. Okay. So yeah, there we go. Um, so that's my warlock. Um, reputation wise, she's pretty much exalted with everyone except for that pagel because that's just a pain in the ass. Um, yeah, and currency stuff. So as for add-ons that I use for WoW, um, I use NPC Scan and Altaholic for all of my characters. Archie and Atlas loot I kind of use when I feel like I need to. Um, I use Bagnon, which brings your bags up in one window and you can move them around, which is really handy. Um, and I use um, Battle Pet Quality Notifier. 
Um, I use decursive for the characters that need it. Heal bots for some like off healing. Um, healers have to die for PvP. Um, that just goes along with the um, battle pet quality notifier. Um, I use Mogget. Omen for threat. Um, OQ I need to get rid of now. Um, rare coordinator for timeless isle, which I will get rid of. Um, Skata for my damage meter. Um, Tom Tom for the little arrow up here. Trade forwarder. So that if someone else in my guild has the same add on, I can just see trade chat wherever I am. And then, of course, DVM and all the DVM parts. So that's what I use for add ons. Um, so, as for um, the other stuff that I have, like collection wise, I don't have much in the toy box yet. I've got 43 out of 197, which I didn't really have a lot of bag space on this character, so I never really looked into um, farming for them or anything. I did finally get the Sky Mirror though, so I was happy. Um, pets, I have 470. Um, so if I filter those by level, so that is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Yes, yeah, so I have 6 currently at level 25. And the rest are kind of varied. Um, I usually work um, on my pets on my mage because she has teleports and that makes it a lot easier. So, yeah. Lots of pets. Lots and lots of pets. Um, some of my favourites. I haven't marked them all as favourites yet. But um, I have my little Zandalaris my warg. They have the new kitty ones from Halloween. They have white kittens. And rats. I have the weird Venus flytrap one. Um, where are all my rare ones? I don't really know if I have any super rare ones. Oh, my stitch pop from Max. And some of the Pet store mounts, uh, pet yeah, pet store and then mount store. I have the elemental. Too many of those things. And yes, I just have lots of different random ones. I've gotten that thing so many times now, and I still don't have ashes, which is really frustrating. Lots of pets. Some of these I'm going to be leveling up and selling. So that's why I have multiples of them. <laughs> I have two of those ones. I didn't realize I had two of those. But yes, I have lots of pets. And I haven't marked all of them as favourites yet, but I have a little ginger kitty that I've called Illidan. Of course. Why not? Um, mounts, I have 186 at the moment. Um, so I have some of the pet store mounts. I was lucky enough to get the challenge mode ones done. I got this one last week, I believe. Um, that's the guild one, and the pet store one, he changes colours. <laughs> Last Friday I got the Karazhan mount, it's like the twelfth time that I've run it. Um, Raptor from that one. I finally got my Hello's End mount, it's six years, waiting to get that. And that's the um, Garrosh Hellscream ahead of the curve. And I got my another in-game one and my Horde Chopper, which is pretty awesome. And yeah, just the rest of my mounts. 186 of them, it's quite a bit. 
and more in-game shop ones. I got that one yesterday. The um, 25 man Alduar meta Drake, which is pretty cool. And I have my nether wings that took forever. That was such a pain in the ass to grind through some of the old rep. Let's see, what else do I have in here? There was another one I just got. Oh, and the Huolon Mount from the Timeless Isle. I was so happy when I finally got that because there's still like hundreds of people that just sit there and wait for it to spawn. So, And I got that one on Friday as well. My second run through of the stone core. So that was really lucky. Um, what else? Oh, that's guild. That's the wrong tab. That one. Um, yeah, so I'm not... I didn't do any BGs or anything like that. I keep starting to and then I don't. So, um, yeah. I have nearly 15,000. I'm like halfway to 15,000. So my feats of strength. Um, Fiery Horseman's Brain. Headless Horseman. Um, I got the red Karaji mount yesterday. Um, I got my green fire before the patch. Um, there's my head of the curve. Um, Hearthstone. And 2013 BlizzCon. Did I get one for this year's? No, I didn't. That's weird. I didn't get one. Um, collector's edition mount and pet. Um, over 9,000, which is, yes. Um, Little Deathwing, 6th anniversary. I did the Dreadsteed quest before they took it away. Um, yeah, Frostwolf. And Legacy, what are all these ones? That looks like Challenge Modes and Rathian, Battle of Points, Darkspear. Oh yeah, S level 60 version of Anixia. Hmm, I haven't got those ones. Um, so garrisons I'm looking forward to. So, I've already, I've already picked out which ones are going, which ones I'm going to have. They've moved that to there now. Toy box, mounts. I have three mounts still to get for that one that I'm working on. Um, working on this one as well. 167. I thought I had. Oh, okay, it doesn't count all of them. Alright. Um, pet battles. Again, kind of getting there. It's probably what I'm going to be doing while I'm waiting for. Um, for Warlords. I have all of the metas for that. Oh wait, there's a new one. Okay, I missed one. Um, so, most of those. And rep. Still don't have 50. That's really annoying. Um, professions. I have one of everything, so now I have that one, Master of All. Um, quite a few metas for dungeons. The one I'm really proud of. I haven't got it yet. I was hoping I'd have it by now, but I just haven't been PvPing. But I'm less than 500 kills away from 50,000 kills. So that's really exciting. I can't wait to get that one. And exploring. I have the Explorer. I have Lawmaster. God, that's so many. Yeah, so I have double agent and mm, all the maximum levels one. I went and got all the um, pet ones. The slash love pet ones. And yeah, I just spent a lot of time. Basically while I was in between guilds, that's what I did. Alright, so sometimes I like to look at the um, stats one as well so yeah lots of quests completed 
Lots of things killed. Largest hit dealt. Hmm. Not bad. 4.5 million. Yeah, okay. I don't really duel people, so that's not very high. <coughs> I look at the gold, like total gold acquired, I'm really sad because I don't have nearly that much gold. Vanity pets, bandages, flight paths, honorable kills on this character. Um, number of hugs. It tracks some really weird kills, like an up guard keep one. I've done all these ones. It's really weird. But it doesn't it's just really odd the ones that it decides to a really odd way to track things. Anyway. See, some of these are off, because I have more than that. That's really strange. I don't know why that's not showing. Oh, that's because I haven't done them on that character. Okay. Yeah, that's alright. Okay, so basically, yeah, that's what I have on my characters. I've been spending a lot of time doing mount runs and all that kind of good stuff. Just killing time for warlords. Um, getting my bags and my bank ready. <coughs> my bank is way too full of transmog gear. I have two pairs of those. I should get rid of one pair of those. Yeah, so I really wish they'd change some of these things into toys already because it's kind of silly that some of these aren't toys. So, yeah. Lots and lots of transmog gear. This is just in my bank, this is not even my void storage, which has even more transmog gear. <coughs> so I need to move some of it over so I have a bit more space in here. You can kind of tell which character I spend most of my time on. I love that staff. I should make a new transmog with that. I think I might. Yep. <coughs> so, yeah, that's about it. I don't really know what else to show, like... I'm I'm pretty much just clearing stuff out, trying to get a few last achievements done, um, while I'm waiting for Warlord to drain ore. Yeah, cockroaches. I don't know why cockroaches are a thing. <coughs> Didn't mean to do that. Anyway, that's it for my kind of wow show off for now. Um, I might attach, I have some other wow clips and stuff that I might just attach to the end of this to see how it goes. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much how I play WoW and some of the things I've done. So, until Warlords of Draenor, I will see you guys later.